As we all know, on Tuesday, December 17th, Steelers linebacker number 50, Larry Foote, came to Greensburg to talk to the students about academics, character, leadership, scholarship, and service. We here at GSTV3 were able to get an exclusive interview with him. Well, I'm here with Steelers linebacker Larry Foote, and just let me tell you, it's great to have you. I mean, I know I'm really excited. Um, so, do you feel as a role model to some of your kids that it's a responsibility for you to sort of come out in the community like this? Absolutely. I know the platform that I've been given, uh, you know, just playing football. I know how, especially in Pittsburgh and where I'm from, football players and athletes are looked upon. And uh, you can lead them in a negative or a positive way. And uh, I choose to lead them in a positive way, just off the field. You know, I, I take pride in and responsibility and not having my name and any negative stories on TV. So uh, I just I love coming out, giving back, just sharing some of my story with the young people. All right, so I know enough about football in Western Pennsylvania to know that there's a great pride in the Pittsburgh Steelers. So what is it like to play for the city of Pittsburgh and to wear the black and gold? Oh, it's awesome. You know, uh, I played one year for my hometown, Detroit, and the most disappointing part was because I thought all NFL teams, when you travel on the road, you're going to travel like rock stars. But when I was in Detroit, probably two people at our whole hotel on the road. So uh, I definitely miss playing for the black and gold. You know, we go places, we take over stadium, stadiums, hotels always sold out. So uh, it's an honor to play for the Steeler Nation. All right. So you've been a big part of the Steeler, like the Steelers for a long time now. Um, what is your most memorable moment? of your Steelers career? Well, it had to be the first Super Bowl. Uh, us having our backs against the wall, had to win the remaining five or six games just to make it. And uh, we did that. Uh, we were underdogs the whole year, probably until the Super Bowl game, where we finally made everybody believe in us. And uh, it was just awesome winning the Super Bowl in my hometown. All right, well, thanks a lot for coming. Thanks um, for having me. Yeah, it was great. You got a future in this business. <laughs>